question that I have been grappling with a lot lately, and I'd love to know other people's thoughts on it. So, do you think that it is reasonable to be at our healthiest self at all times? And should we always prioritize our healthiest self? Or is it okay to sometimes compromise our healthiest self in the name of other goals? I have been really working with that question or grappling with it lately um, because I have been making some sacrifices in my own health because I've had other priorities that I've wanted to give my attention to, or wanted is a strong description there, um, that I felt compelled to, I felt obligated to. And, um, and I have been justifying my lack of health prioritization in the name of, of other needs. And I was okay with that for a while until it became kind of a few months on end. Um, and then I realized like this is how we fall into the putting ourselves last because we continue and consistently prioritize other things over our health. And so instead I've been trying to reframe my approach because I think that in the name of health, it's impossible to maintain all categories all of the time. Um, and that's just life, right? That's okay. Um, and I don't necessarily expect to meet my healthiest self all the time. But what I've realized is that I definitely want to try to make the best choices I can given the current circumstances and sometimes that just means choosing the things that support my health that are not overwhelming at the time. Now here's an example. I am one who touts how important sleep is. Like hands down, one of the best things that we can do for our health is sleep. It really is important to regulating our hormones and, and healing and making those neuron connections and sleep is incredibly vital to both mental and physical health. Um, and lately, that has been what I've been sacrificing, right? It's, it's kind of what we do in this society. We sacrifice sleep. It's one of the first things to go when we get busy. And I feel, for me, right now, trying to maintain an adequate amount of sleep is super overwhelming. And it's overwhelming because getting to sleep is difficult because my plate is so full that my brain is having a hard time slowing down at night. So... Um, so that's an issue in and of itself. And there are definitely tactics that I could be using that I'm not. I'll be honest. I'm not using journaling. I'm not winding down at night properly. I'm not meditating. I'm not turning off screens as I should be. Um, there are a lot of things that I'm failing to do on my end to get to, to sleep faster. Um, but also, I have a lot of um, stress happening right now in my life. And so I'm not necessarily managing that in a way that makes good deep sleep possible anyway. So I, if, even if I try to go to bed at a decent hour, I'm so worried about all of the things that I have to do that I can't shut down and do that. And this is a common problem and I recognize that. Um, but it's one that I am not sure I'm willing to tackle right now. And then I got to thinking, is that okay? Is that okay with me? Is that okay that I am not willing to prioritize this thing that is unbelievably and undeniably important? Um, and I know it's not permanent, um, but it's it's what I, I feel like I need to do right now because I have so much going on. And I just... I just go back and forth about, you know, prioritizing health overall, or is it okay to sometimes put some features of health on the back burner? Now, on the flip side of that, even though I have 100% of my sleep go by the wayside, which is falling into old habits, right? There's that habit talk again, how important habits are. Um, definitely falling into old habits. You get busy, you let go of sleep. 
Um, I have been maintaining other aspects of my health. So that's just, that's what I mean by I am trying to choose the healthiest self I can be in this situation, which is not overall my healthiest self, period, right? So in this situation, I can do things like prioritize my nutrition um, and my water. So my nutrition and my water have been pretty on point. But that's about all I can handle right now. Um, I haven't been working out as much as I'm used to. I haven't had as much energy to do that because I haven't been sleeping. Um, but above all else, I'm still managing to make better choices most of the time when I am eating. And for now, I think that has to be good enough. Um, and I have to give myself some grace in that being good enough right now because I started to get a little bit negative on myself, which is uh, lately has been kind of not the norm. I've really been pretty enthusiastic about, I don't know, health in general. Um, but this summer took a bit of a toll on me. And if you've been following my kind of life at all lately, uh, you know, I got really overwhelmed with a lot of moving parts of life. And I had to start making some choices about prioritization. So anyway, just some thoughts on my way to work this morning. Um, is it okay to sometimes shelf your healthiest self in the name of other priorities? Or should we always be targeting our best self regardless?